the kind of Daiso Hall. If you don't know what it is, it's like a Japanese um, Dollar Tree slash 99 cent store, but uh -huh. almost everything in their store is a dollar fifty. Um, so yes, it's my first time. I didn't buy much, but we're gonna show you guys. Ready? Yeah. And most of the items are one dollar fifty or. Four dollars. They have some for three, five, but most of them are a dollar fifty. And the first thing we bought are these cotton squares, and they're just for like makeup remover and to clean your face. Let me see the quality. And these are one of those. Um, I also bought these on um, face masks. It's just to like kind of like moist your skin, I guess. So you um, can I don't know. I don't really understand what it says. It's in Japanese. Um, but yeah, it's a face mask, face mask, and there's three of them in this. And this was also a dollar fifty. Can I do the Can I do one? Can I do one? Um, this is the eye. Eyebrow. I built in the ready. Okay, let me see. So I bought this um eyebrow pencil in a dark brown color. Uh -huh. And dark brown. I don't know. I heard some other YouTubers talking about it, saying it's a really good product. Um. Mm -hmm. I don't know, we would have to try it. We have to try that. I don't really do makeup, as you can tell, but lately I've been doing my eyebrows. So, let's see. This is oh. how it looks. You have one already, Ma. This. Um, uh, you can use it. Hold on. Can I see that? Yeah, it's kind of hard. I, I don't know if you guys can see it. I don't know. If, I don't know. But we're, we're gonna try it and we'll let you guys know. And on this side, it's pretty cool. It has a little um, eyebrow brush. So we'll see. Okay. What else? Um, I also bought this big plastic um case. It's like a thick um plastic. Can you sit down right? It's a big plastic um, bag and it's a big plastic so I actually bought this because I kind of like I bought this because I think I can use it um, whenever we travel somewhere um, to put like all the toothbrush, toothpaste and all those little deodorants and all that travel size item um, so yeah we're gonna be going to a family camp um, like in two weeks so this would be good for that and then we're also gonna be um, going on vacation sometime yeah, in September so that might also be good for us. Ooh, are you eating a tostada? what else? I also bought cupcake holders these are the aluminum it's a really good deal and I like baking so Me too. The holder. I also bought this I needed one and it comes with the bottom for whenever you're actually like draining something it's a kitchen item by the way um, it's plastic white basic so yeah whenever you like we make salsas or something um, we have to drain it and you don't want little pieces going to your liquid so this is pretty good and it comes you know together both of them for a dollar fifty and I found this little cute flowery apron for you can touch um yeah it's for when we're cooking I don't own one kind of weird and yeah I've been Hi. I've been wanting to buy one um, because yes, I always get myself dirty when cooking, if you guys can see right there. So I found this little cute flower one. I like it because it looks very shabby and vintage. I love all those kind of like 
prints. And I also paid a dollar fifty for this one. And this one I believe is like cotton. Like you can let me see. Yeah, it's polyester and 70% polyester and 30% cotton. So it's very thick and I think it's gonna be very good for cooking. So that's all we bought. Oh no, she also you bought the little she bought a little ice cream um calculator which where's it at? In the car. Yeah, she left it in the car and my son also bought little um what was it? Toys? It's little dinosaur erasers which are no, really cute because they come with their little egg. But he's gonna use them as toys, but they're erasers. And that's all we bought. I spent like fifteen dollars, sixteen. And um, we're gonna give it a try. I don't know. Um, it's the first time I was there, and honestly, we didn't have much time to really look around. Plus, I had the two kids with me. It's kind of hard, but yeah, I think I'm gonna be going there soon again. So yes, no. this was our Daiso haul, and I we hope you guys enjoy. And if you get a so the closest one we had was in Claremont Mesa, and. Yeah, it's pretty interesting. Subscribe if you haven't. It's free. Like our videos and comment down below. Bye. Pues si les que se esperen. Yes, it. Really?